Hi again everyone. Yeah, I'm doing this again against my better judgement. Uh, we'll pick up where we left off. Main reason I am doing it is because I've got a little bit of installation problems with uh, Mar Oblivion at the minute, which I was going to be recording today, but I'm not. Uh, I against my better judgement again. Um, I tried to update the version of Mar Oblivion I was using to the latest one and it basically completely fucked over my installation and I'm having to rebuild it again from scratch using all the mods I had before and all that kind of jazz and it's taking forever but I'll get back to it soon enough so I'm doing this for a little while instead uh... yeah now then um... wait a minute which one is... I'm guessing it's number two that I was doing if we start off near some stairs in a dark room, then I'll be right. Uh, yeah, we're in a dark room at the bottom of uh, two flights of stairs, and I don't know what the fuck is in there, and... I believe we just fell through the floor. Oh, joy. Try that again. I don't really want to have to start again from the beginning. That would kind of suck. Wait, okay, right, we are, we're somewhere, because I can hear footsteps when I move, but, what? Oh yeah, someone told me it's space to blink, uh, which is really freaking awesome, and that batteries uh, are for using uh, flashlights and stuff that you find. Um, hang on a second, there we go. Uh, what the fuck, though? Seriously, what's going on? I can't see anything. Oh, please tell me the game's not fucking bugged the fuck out. Because that's really annoying. We got really fucking far. Yeah, it looks like it's fucking screwed. Oh well. Um, let's not enable the intro sequence. I can't be bothered. I'm all... Oh right, name. Fucking type properly. God damn it. Right, there we go. We'll start again from the very beginning. Fucking joy of joys. Oh well. Never mind. Hopefully this time I can save in a spot that won't uh, involve me dying by falling through the floor or something. This side is experiencing multiple keto and Euclid level containment breaches. Full side lockdown initiated. Yes, yes, yes. Heard this all before, my friend. What the devil? Never been here before. Electrical center. Caution admittance to authorized personnel only. Yeah, I need a key card. Thought as much. Hmm. Well, let's just keep going on until we find somewhere with a key card. Uh, I can hear him in there. He's in there. I heard it. I heard something move. Motherfucker. Wait a minute. Have we already been in here? No, this is a different bit. And wait a minute, are those... Yeah, those are both batteries. Gas mask, bit of paper... Nah, uh, useless. Oh Christ, really? This shit again? Okay, never mind. Uh, uh no 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 no, it's F1 to save in it. Yeah. Right. <coughs> uh 
fucking sweep made it through. Although he coughed up some of the gas, but still. Uh, didn't want to put the gas mask on, because otherwise you can't s fucking see anything. Oh, that's one of these rooms. What are you? Something I've read before? Yes, we've read that before. Away with you. Now, is there a key card around here somewhere? I think you find key cards in these rooms. But I could be wrong. I heard a stone scraping sound, which is the sound that it makes. What the hell is that? Revision eye drops. Ooh. Um, what is that? Radio transceiver. What the devil? Use the one to five keys to change the channel. Huh? Oh, does it need batteries? Yeah, there we go. Channel one. Channel two, three. <laughs> no way! <laughs> On site radio, brilliant. What else is there? It won't go up to six, seven, or eight, I'm afraid. Or nine. Apparently. Um, that's kind of hilarious. Wow, the battery's going down on this pretty fast. Right. Um, <laughs> that was a bit bizarre, but anyway. Uh, anything else? No, we don't need a random keyboard, do we? That'd be silly. Cool. Well, we found that and some eye drops. For all the good in the world, it'll do us. Thing here, no. I don't really know what, how you use the eye drops. I guess there's something to do with blinking. Um, no, no, no. F1 and go. That needs a key card that way, which we don't have. Another room? I mean, okay, fine. Uh, let's drop a battery for a second. See if there's anything new. Mobile task forces, okay. Um, security clearance level, level one. Mobile task forces. Task forces are small groups of people, generally three to ten. Though task forces larger than twenty are not unheard of, dedicated to performing a specific task or dealing with a particular situation. Each task force is assigned a unique combination of a Greek letter and in number. Uh, but otherwise nomenclature is the same for security facilities. Notable NTFs. Uh, Mobile Task Force Alpha 2 aka the Mailmen. Uh, surveillance and containment during routine transportation of safe and nuclear class items between Foundation sites. Mobile, class, mobile Task Force Delta 5, aka front runners, assigned to track down and capture SCPs before rival organizations do. Currently tailing agents from the IRG. Um, mobile Task Force Beta 7, aka Mad Hatters. Um, specialize in the containment of severe biological hazards and the subsequent sanita sanitation of only af any affected areas. Mobile Task Force Eta 10 aka see no evil specializes in the capture quarantine and containment of mimetic hazards uh, mobile task force iota 5 aka tiger bait created for high risk assignments requiring extremely quick reaction times quick currently assigned to locate and terminate instances of scp 2471 okay well fascinating I can drop that though and I want my battery back What's this? Object. Yeah, we've already read that. 
Oh god, yeah, no, battery. That's what I want. That is what I want. Um, what a key card. Give me a goddamn key card. Oh well. weird wall bits. Uh, anyway, another radio, more eye drops, and uh, batteries, same as last time. Okay, what the? It's like an invisible wall thing here, I don't understand. Whatever. Um, ah! I'm getting turned around by it. Some sort of graphical glitch. Anyway. Okay. What the fuck is this? Computers and shit. I don't particularly fancy going in there. Something tells me going in there would be a bad idea. It's some sort of containment thing. I don't know what for what though. Uh we got here. Anything we can take? Anything useful? No, it's all rubbish. Oh, hello. Hang on. Got something up there. Document SCP-372. Uh, object class Euclid, special containment procedures, SCP-372 is to be contained in a cell 5 times 4 times 2 meters, uh, lined with reinforced plexiglass embedded into each of the four walls of this cell will be one infrared motion detector. In the event of a containment breach, an alert will be sounded that all personnel should watch for any brief flickering mo movements in the corner of their eyes and to report immediately if one is sighted. Description SCP. 372 is a creature of unknown genus, approximately 2 meters long from head to tail and weighing approximately 45 kilo kilograms. It has a long, thin body with 8 pairs of narrow limbs. Analysis has shown that its muscle fibers are redacted, uh, for allowing for extremely fast and precise movements. Every part of the body is abnormally flexible and the limbs are coated with small fibers that cling to almost any solid surface. In place of eyes or ears, it has data expunged. Uh, this sensory organ is capable not only of echolocation, echolocation uh, but also of detecting energy transfers such as the electrical impulses in the brains of nearby beings. SCP-372 has learned to time its movements to those pulses, predicting the movements of any being around it. Uh, it uses this technique to hide, either by hiding behind the head of a person looking for it, or by hiding in their scotomas, blind spots and saccades, clipping during eye movement. SCP-372 first came to the attention of the Foundation on blank when an undercover agent working at blank reported seeing, re reported seeing a creature that re resembled the described hallucinations of one of the patients, Mr. Blank. After thorough investigation, SCP-372 was captured via Redacted and was determined that it had, for unknown reasons, been tormenting the unfortunate patient. It had confused him by periodically following him and remaining within sight of him while hiding outside the visual fields of... Um, I don't know. I don't think you can turn the page over. So why is it in here with me, but it could just be behind me the whole time? That's fucking creepy as. But... Something is drawing me to this. I'm gonna save it and we'll just walk in, see if we die or something. Nope. Okay, well. This is basically a dead end, unfortunately. Oh, yes, yeah, this isn't the wall here. CP372. Object class Euclid. With a blank picture, so as far as we know, it could e could very well be in there with us right now. However, it, according to the thing, it's not lethal, so 
technically nothing to worry about, I suppose. Guess we have to head back then. I wish I knew where you, where you could find a key card, because these are annoying. Actually, I need to uh, go check some stuff out. I will be... Right, hang on. Let's... The fuck was that? Don't want to know. Um... Let's, uh, I need to save the game and I'll be back very, very quickly. Um, also, I was going to do something and I forgot what it was. Shit. Never mind. Um, I'm sure it will come back to me. Anyway, TTFN. Uh, this will probably constitute one video, unless it's been a lot shorter than I thought it was, which is often the case with these things. Um, but. Uh, yeah, anyway. Be right back. Well, be right. I'll be back in the next video and I'll see you later. Or if this is all part of one video, then I've just been babbling for no good reason and I'll see you again in a second anyway. Um, so, ta ra!